Hey guys, and welcome back to Alan Wake. When we last left off, we just managed to get to our island. Ooh, focus. Alice had told me about Calden Lake Lodge. The old building used to be a hotel. I see. But these days, it was no longer open to the public. Oh. Yeah, we just managed to get to the island of relaxation. Diver's Island, if you will. And um, we couldn't get the power on in the house. So we came out here to fix the generator. Now, anyway, let's go back inside and uh, see how Alice is doing. I'm sure she's fine. Hey, this looks nice with Alice? all the lights on. Honey? Me too, Alice. The deer fest guests have already started to arrive. Hey! Just ran into one on the ferry. Famous artist, no less. We'll see if we can rope him into an interview later on. Now, let's uh, go to the phones. Caller, you're on KBFFM. Hi, Pat. It's Rose. Why, well, hello, Rose. What's on your mind? I know who that famous artist was. It was Alan Wayne. <sighs> my favorite writer. Well, Rose, I... I just saw him at the diner. Oh, I am so excited he's here. I'm sure he's glad to be here, too. Well, folks, I guess the secret's out. This is Pat Main. I'm KBFF. Well, you tried, Pat. Thank you so much for keeping a Fucking Rose. Pain in the ass. Wow, look at this. Alice wouldn't have come out in the dark. No, I guess she wouldn't have, but this looks pretty cool. What else can we focus at? I couldn't help but imagine all sorts of horrors lurking in the depths below. Well, there might be a few skeletons under there, but I don't think there's going to be too much to worry about. Alan, my friend, we certainly don't have one of those uh, funky diving suits to go exploring with anyway. So let's get back into the house. See what Alice is up to. Probably in the tub. Who knows? Women. Who put the radio out there anyway? Oh, definitely no action in the kitchen. No action out here. And what about any... Oh. Oh, okay. I like where this is going. Come on, Alan. Don't spare the horses. Now, are you in the bedroom? Well, oh, hello. hello there. I'm not the surprise. Oh. Take study. Go take a look. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, oh, uh, what do we get? Oh. Oh. Surprise. Alice? What is this? I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past. Damn, Alice, you, everyone Hey, keeps... hey, hey, just hear me out. There's a <sighs> local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe so now you want to get me committed? No, it's not like that. That's not... Alan? Alan? I don't. Just don't. I don't want to hear it. God damn it, Alice. God damn it. I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. Shit. Oh. What's up, buddy? Everybody just wants you to write a book. Well, that's okay, bud. You just, uh... Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. No worries, Alice. Run away. I'm coming. Oh, shit. What the hell's that? What the fuck is that? I remember that from last time. It's alright, we're coming. Don't even worry about it. Just a little bit of dark. There you go, I shine the torch through the, the, the window for you. Um. Oh, Christ. Oh, no. She's not dead, surely. Okay, I really don't know what's going on. We're in a car now. Waking up in the crashed car felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. Yeah. 
I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. Okay. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. Right, so... Did all... Among Alice's things was a book, The Creator's Dilemma, by a Dr. Emile Hartman. Yeah, uh -huh. the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it, and I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. So, that stuff in the house did happen. Okay, right, well. Alright, Alan, let's go exploring. Oh, shit. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. Well, that's okay. We're no strangers to long hikes through the forest. Damn. Oh, Christ. Good thing we weren't in there anymore, Alan. I hope you've got insurance. Or at least a fat bank account. Anywho, let's not worry about the car. Alice is in danger. Let's go. Now, like I say, I know there's collectibles in this game, but I don't really know Hello? where. Hello? Oh, shit. It's, uh, some funky fireworks up ahead. Hello? Someone there? The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. Oh. Okay. Okay, so I guess we're going to have to act out scenes in his book that he hasn't written yet. That's kind of an in... Hello? Oh, it's alright. It's just Alan breathing away. That's kind of an interesting um, concept, actually. I do like that. Okay. Well, let's keep going. Now, I'm guessing... Anybody there? Please. I've been in an accident. Yeah, I, I don't think they're there to help us, Alan. Yeah, I'm guessing some of these pages are going to be very easy to miss. But that's okay. It's nice to play a game that isn't crashing every five seconds. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. All right, cool. Well, it looks like we've got to go through a logging camp. That's okay. Hello. Now, what we need, we've got a torch, I think. Well, at least not yet, but we need a gun. Anything to find around here. I don't want to do too much exploring just because I'm kind of really interested in the story. Find help. Well, this is kind of convenient. And that looks kind of menacing. Big time. Getting Resident Evil Anybody Revelations there? 2 vibe. Please, I've been in an accident. This obviously predates that by quite a long time. Okay. Hey! Hey, you! Phil! There's been an accident. I need help. Listen, I need to. Cabins for rent in. Oh, hell. Carl Stucky. Please. To beat you. What? Non refundable reservation deposit required. Fair and oh shit, Mr. Stucky. Uh, okay, now if I could have a gun, I'd be a lot happier. But I guess we're gonna have to make do without for now. All right, let's get through here. Premium cabins. What is he spouting his nonsense about? I mean, obviously he rented us the cabin and all. Oh, manuscript. Script page. All right. Okay. Hey, buddy. Yes. 
failed to arrive? Is he saying we failed to arrive? Oh crap! Ow! That was kind of painful. Well, at least hopefully we'll be safe in here. Here's Johnny! Ducky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's convenient. An energizer. Branded torches. Right. Cool. We now have a weapon. And energizers. I thought they had Duracells for some reason. During your... Trying... Nordic walking, Nordic walking eh? Proven health benefits, eh? Oh, that's handy. You can see the sights and keep those cholesterol levels down. Oh, I see. Fair enough. Well, I'm not finding the enemy scary at all. Ah. Hello? Hello? Yeah, well, that's a bit of a problem. Well, okay. Oh, shit. Are you serious, Stucky? You dick? What are you doing? Oh, God. Okay. Bad things. How do... Ah. How do we get out of here? Are we dead? We're dead. Okay, I think I went to the wrong area. Right, let's pick up all the stuff. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. We know all about your Nordic walking. And I don't like where you're going with that. And I'm sure we're going to be doing lots of walking and running. Right. Can we mash... Surely we have to leave through here. Yeah, it's all right, Alan. Okay. Come on, you pussy. Let's get this done. Okay. Um. Uh. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. There we go. You want to go by? There you go. Right. Where did... Oh, Christ. See you later, cabin. We hardly knew you. Um... Okay, well, at least we got some bullets and we got a torch. At least that's something. The Focus. Had gone over the cliff with the office. I hope Stucky had suffered the same fate, but I wasn't planning on staying to find out. Yeah, well, I'd wager he's just fine. I mean, he's not fine. He's clearly crazy and possessed by some weird shit, but... <laughs> some weird shit. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm sure he's he's kind of fine. Revolver ammo. Oh, okay. All right, buddy. Come on. Well, I'm not afraid of you. I have a 38. Well, who knows what this thing is. Come on, you. Ooh. Tried to dodge. Didn't quite work. There we go. All right, you got your crazy friend after me. Sickling my ass. Ooh. Get out of it. My ass. Doesn't need your sickle. To be honest, it's perfectly fine without it. There we go. That's how we deal with these ominous aberrations. Fired a gun outside the shooting range, and now I just killed someone or something. There were bodies. They just disappeared. Think. I was dreaming. It felt real enough to make me sick. I don't think you killed anybody, Alan. I'm just saying. Ah, it's interesting. Eerie hand-painted graffiti was revealed by my flashlight. Someone had hidden a chest of supplies near it. Oh. Flare gun. Well, I admire your enthusiasm, Alan, but we'll uh, use the flare gun probably a little bit later on. So. Oh, I see. So I wonder if we can find manuscript pages the same way. I wonder if they're kind of hidden through these uh, yellow writings. Now, can we do anything with this? Yes, we can. I see. 
Okay, interesting. Now, I wonder if any light heals us, or does it have to be specific? I'm not sure. Kick. That worked. I think. The dark forest was the last place I wanted to go, but I had no choice. I had to get to the gas station. Yeah, buddy. Don't think we have any choice, my friend. Let's go. At least the power's up. What have we got over here? I thought I saw some yellow writing. Uh, maybe not. Okay. Fair enough. Alright, Alan. Let's go to the gas station. Oh. Does that blow up? No, that does not. Come on, buddy. Let's get that little cloak of darkness off you. I wonder what this darkness is. I wonder if it's ever explained. Or do they pull a destiny and just keep talking about darkness as if it's actually some physical thing? And in actuality, even the writers don't know what they're talking about. Typical <coughs> Destiny stuff. Oh, hello. Looks like a page over here. Or a light. Ah. So the pages are lit up pretty well. Alright. What I might do, depending on how long each um, area is, I might just run through it. And then run through it again a second time and collect all the stuff. That might be an easier way of doing things. Now, I said something about F5. Ah, look at this. Wow, there's a lot of pages. Departure by Alan Wake. Right. Turned to face me. His face was covered in shadows. It was hard to make him out in the darkness of the forest that surrounded us. But the axe he lifted was plain to see. It glistened with the blood of his victim. He grinned madly. The shadows were alive, distorting his features. It was a scene from a nightmare. But I was awake. Oh, okay. Actually, what we might do here then. Yeah. I'll try and find all these pages off camera. And. Oh, oh yeah, because oh, so I must have got to episode two when I originally played this. Um, yeah, I try and find them all off camera, and when we finish a chapter, we we'll read all of the manuscript pages. I think that's the best way to do it. I didn't realize Alan. Yeah, I think that's quite good. I I like the way Alan actually reads them out. That's cool. Oh shit! So what do we quickly see there? A baby drowning. At least that's what it looked like. I have no idea, Alan. It looked like a baby drowning to me. Um, anywho, let's keep going. At least Alan moves fairly fast. I like that. can well, definitely feel the max... Below. Something uncoiled itself inside my head. Oh. I realized that I'd have to find a way across. I didn't even want to look at the water. Ah, don't worry about it, bud. We'll be fine, I'm sure. Careful. Don't slip now. There you go. Wasn't so hard, was it? We'll get you through this, buddy. Don't you even worry about it. Now. I'm assuming down here there might be stuff to pick up. Not quite sure how the exploring is going to... No, maybe not. Not quite sure how exploring is going to work in this game. Is it going to be quite a linear path or are there going to be little kind of extra areas that you can you can kind of find? Well, I guess we'll find out. Over we go. Sorry, right, Alan. Oh, hello. Maybe not. Is it just you? Well, he certainly seems to be adamant to um, advertise his businesses. I assume they're his businesses. Well, that's good. Even in death, he's still advertising his own stuff. Ah, look. What's that over there? That could be stuff. And if there's one thing we need, it's stuff. There we go. 
Where was that? That was like over here somewhere. Ah, here we go. Manuscript page for me, perhaps? Oh, shit, almost. Yeah, it is as well. <coughs> now, the one thing I'm confused with are these actually manuscript pages that I've already picked up? I'm assuming. So there's that one there. Wake fights with a t taken with a light. Mm. Okay. Okay. All right, Colin Allen, let's go. My throat is getting really sore. I think I've got your bug. Which means I'm not going to be able to record for a few days. Which means I'm going to be bored. Uh, right. Okay. What do we have there? Ah, look. Bullets. And lights. Oh, hang on. They're <laughs> Sorry, they're not just any batteries. They're lithium batteries. I see. Alan wouldn't put any old shit in his torch. Oh, I see. That's just so you can kind of look over there and see the stuff. Gotcha. Right. Well, let's keep going. Hey, checkpoint reached. Oh, Christ. Hey, buddy. Come on. Now, let's kill you. There you go. Oh, nasty sod. Come on, you. Don't you throw in your insert batteries. Um... See, you don't have to insert batteries there. You can just wait for the torch to recharge, which is cool. Hey, we've got an achievement. Can't read it here. Too far away from the TV. Something about a gun strobe, I think. Right. Okay. I don't know how rare batteries are going to be. We're getting tons of them, but... I don't know if the whole game's going to be like that. Come on, Alan. You can get up there. Good lad. Okay. Uh, looks like another logging camp. So what's this way? Huh. Hey, hello. What's up here? I wonder if this is a manuscript page that I've missed. Looks like there's going to be a lot of them as well. But that is okay. Ah, look at this. Taken. They're taken. The taken are filled with darkness. So they're called the taken, the enemies are. Good to know. Hey. So what's in the box? Probably just lith oh, okay. Oh, we can carry a lot of batteries. I mean it makes sense. Batteries are small. Heavy, but small. Heavy in large quantities, anyway. Alright, <clears throat> cool. I was hoping a manuscript, uh, manuscript page would be in there, but I think we've pretty much got all of them already for this chapter. Right. Okay. I thought we could only hold ten. That might have been Outlast, actually. A lot of people praised Outlast, but I didn't think it was a very good game. I thought it was a bit boring. People usually get really offended when I say that. The staircase was broken. I had to make my way up some other way. Okay. Yeah, me and my mate, uh, we sat down and um, we completed it in one sitting. And I don't know. It was just... I thought the story was rubbish. Which is a major deal breaker in a game. Hello, what's this? There was no power. There was bound to be a generator. So yes, I can side. see. So generators are going to be a thing. I assume. But then that makes sense because we're playing with light a lot. Ah, hello. Oh, hey, buddy. Didn't see you there. Ow, didn't see you. Oh, I see. You're the way over there. Like, damn it. Should have dodged. Right, let's put a battery in that thing. Oh dear. These guys are pretty angry. Hey, got one of them. 
Nice. Insert battery. He's pretty quick at inserting batteries. Torches usually take... Oh, shit. Take a bit of... Ooh, fiddling with. Unless that's some kind of patented uh, energizer special torch that has some quick release and reload system. You never know. We are living in the world of tomorrow, after all. Right, okay. Just three? Ah, health actually recharged. That's kind of interesting. I'm assuming it only recharges when we're in the light, though. Which, again, makes sense. Ah, a little safety area. Gotcha. Okay, so what's in here? Hey, a manuscript page. And... Oh, a shotgun. Don't remember getting a shotgun. We'll hold on to that puppy for later. Now, hang on, with a shotgun. Oh, no, we still can use the torch at the same time. Good to know. Alright. Alright, let's get out of here. God damn, there could be pages everywhere. Well, there probably are pages everywhere, to be honest. Reach the path above. Okay. How hard can that be? Oh. Little secret area? Nope. No such thing for Alan. Right, I assume we've got to get on top of the log somehow. In fact, I know we do because I kind of remember that. Ah, yes. Push the button. What does this button do? Oh. Ah, okay. I was not expecting that. There we go. Now we have a path. Trouble is, ah, I see. Right, okay, cool. All right, Alan. Good work, buddy. Good work. We'll make a tree surgeon out of you yet, Lado. I suppose when you're hun hunting these taken fellows, you don't really need to be a tree surgeon. Oh, God. Bigger fresh fish to fry and all that. All right. Another checkpoint and reach. These checkpoints are quite frequent. I like that. It helps out massively when you're recording. Hello. Shotgun ammo. Nice. Well, I was just outside for a breath of fresh air and what a night. I, I know most of you are probably in your beds by now, but if you're still up and around, take a moment. Step outside for a spell and breathe in deep. The weather is absolutely still. The sky is crystal clear. It's like the forest is quietly breathing along with you. Do listeners know I'm, I'm a night owl, and it's on nights like this I wish I wasn't cooped up in the studio. Huh. Makes an old man like me wish I could just roam wild. <laughs> but here I am, and it would keep you company all night long if I weren't. Uh, it looks like uh, I'm not the only one staying up late. Caller, you're on the air. Hey. Huh. Hello, Maurice. What are you up to? Well, I was just taking Toby on his walk. Oh, <laughs> isn't it beautiful out there? Sure, but Pat, the reason I called is that Toby heard something rustling in the undergrowth and took off after it, and I couldn't find it. Probably a rabbit. Sure. Toby loves rabbits. Well, sure. Anyway, I figured that, you know, if anyone runs into Toby, they could grab him. My number's on his collar. And Toby's a friendly dog? <laughs> well, Maurice, it's out there now. Hope Toby comes home soon. Yeah, thanks, Pat. You have a good night now. Huh, okay. So we have a missing dog out there somewhere. Hopefully he's not going to chew our face off. But you never know. The music is quite good. Okay, another box of goodies. Hey, a flare gun. Oh, I see. So, a flare gun is kind of like a single-use item. Makes sense. My scroll rule will is pissing me off. Right. Let's go exploring. Oh, I see. That music is actually what's playing on the radio. That kind of makes sense. 
Hey, more pages. Yoink. Hmm. <coughs> the gas station was closer now. It's light welcoming in the darkness. Yeah, I'm sure it's going to be a very. Well, aren't you a pillar of the community? Ah, uh, looks like shit's about to get weird again. Oh, Christ. Hello. Evening, Governor. Nice to see ya. And a beautiful evening it is as well. Have some bullets for your trouble. Ah, you're not the only one out here for a midnight stroll. It's becoming quite the hobby by the look of things. Oh, shit. Midnight stroll in the yeah, nice midnight stroll in the forest. Lovely. Down to 27 rounds. That's okay. I'm sure we'll find more. Well, things are getting really freaking weird now. Uh oh. Oh, Christ. Come on, Alan. There you go, buddy. Oh, God, there's a couple of them now. Well, I am pretty sure we're not going to need our shotgun for these bad boys. There we go. You're fucked now, Lado. Nice. Three rounds is the magic number. Get back. Damn lumberjacks. Going crazy in the midnight. I don't know if that's a common problem. Ah, maybe it is for Alan Wake. There we go. Another page. Okay. Don't know how far we have to go. Oh, hello. Checkpoint reached. Right, guys. I'm actually going to leave it here. Because we're on half an hour. When we come back, I guess we're going to continue on to the gas station. Really enjoying the atmosphere of this game, actually. It's really good. So I hope you're enjoying it, too. Thanks for watching, guys. And until next time.